Hey, hey everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Q3 of the bi-weekly Contest 76, Design an ATM Machine. So this one, I think it's just doing what they tell you. Um, the only key thing to notice is that... Uh, the only thing to notice is that... Um, amount is 10 to the 9. So you can't do anything like... Well, both the amount and the banknotes count is 10 to the 9. So you, you have to, one, be careful about overflows um, which I didn't have to do to be honest because I'm using Python but also um, that you can't do something as silly as like you know take out you can't count one banknote at a time so you have to be a little bit careful um, but other than that and you can honestly just use some uh, fundamental maths I mean it may take a little bit but like you know if you haven't done it before you have to write it out or whatever, but it should be okay. And then you have to just make sure that you can take out all the amounts. Um, yeah, and that's pretty much it. So we'll go for the code because I don't think there's anything that tricky per se. Uh, I think one thing that people have said on a, in my Discord comments is that it's easy to make this typo. So make sure you have the, the input correct, obviously, uh, and the denominations correct. Um, but yeah, when I initialize it with this, you can put it in, in a constant outside uh, in a static way, but that's fine. I mean, I, I just kind of, you know, this is contest code, so forgive me for not being a little queen. Uh, so while you do that, add deposit your like button, your subscribe button, and your comments in the Discord or below or whatever. Huh, I got nothing. But yeah, but deposit, it is what it sounds like. So when you have these bank notes, you just add them to the counts and just deposit them. Uh, and then withdraw. Um, yeah, uh, withdraw it is probably the hard part because this is just adding numbers on the folder. But I don't even know if there's any way to do that, like in a way such that, like, how do you? I was, I don't know if there's another way of doing it. To be frank, I mean, I mean, obviously you could just write like a dictionary or something like that. But I don't. I mean, yeah, for the most part, same idea. Uh, here, um, and they tell you the algorithm with that machine is not allowed to use the 200 nodes etc so you have to do it in essentially they're telling you to implement the greedy solution so then you do um i start with keeping track that the answer we have no notes and then for each going from the highest to the the smallest um we i think i used the good variable names here basically i calculate how many i can use which is the amount that it takes or how many notes that we have um we set that to be the answer and then we track how many, how much money we would have withheld, and also subtract the amount. Um, actually, actually, I don't. I, I actually wrote this in a weird way. Now that I see it, uh, this total is not used at all, so you can just ignore it. Because I was going to do one or the other, but then, eh, but then I think it would have been like amount minus total or something like that. So you can definitely do it that way. But yeah. But then with at very end, very end, if amount is equal to zero, then you're good. Otherwise, you have to return negative one because you just don't have to write bills. Otherwise, you subtract the bills, give your money to your customer, and then return the answer. And that's pretty much it. Um, this is going to be O of 5. So O of constant, O of 1. This is also O of 5 or O of 1, O of constant. You could also say maybe O of D for denominations or something like that. The, the, the cardinal uh, of that, but cardinality. But either way, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I have for this one. I imagine that like this is all, all, all of constant, so this is, should be really fast. Um, and that, like the only place that you would have maybe possibly made a mistake is if you did this in a for loop, then it would be very expensive um, because te it's 10 to the 9. But otherwise, yeah, should be good. Um, that's all I have for this one. Let me know what you think, and you could watch me solve it live in the contest now.
here on the other return negative one okay that's not possible That's not right, is it? <laughs> oh, hmm. that's silly. Oh, am I? Uh, uh, this could be a lot. Okay. Wasn't super confident. Like, I was, yeah. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's problems. Uh, yeah. Uh, happy holidays. There's uh, happy Easter, happy Passover, and happy Ramadan. Happy Thai New Year. And probably missing a few. Let me know if I missed them in the comments. Uh, stay good. Stay healthy. Take good mental health. I'll see you later. Bye bye.